All right, so this is our play called Wheel. Um, the, the Spurs run this a lot to Tim Duncan to get him a, a good post up. Um, the play starts uh, similar to um, a lot of our other sets, four out, one in. Uh, the key difference being um, the other post on, in this situation, um, the four, um, the ball side post, is typically in our four out, one in sets, um, typically that post is down on the block. Um, in this situation, um, the ball side post is up at the elbow. So the first thing that happens um, is we swing the ball to um, the post that we're eventually looking to post up. So wherever we see the mismatch, um, he will be aware um, the number five man is right now. So the first thing we do is we swing the ball to the number five. Once we pass the ball there, uh, the one follows his pass to um, to that same corner where the ball just went to. Um, the three is starting to clear out. And um, number two, the opposite wing, is starting to work his man down and is starting to come off a screen from the four man. Uh, at this point, uh, there's kind of two things going on that's opening up uh, an area on the floor. Um, as you just saw in the last step, um, as the one passed the ball to the five, he kind of uh, followed his pass all the way to the opposite corner. Um, number three uh, continued to clear out that side, and he went to uh, the opposite corner. And as this kind of two different misdirections happen at the same time, uh, leaves the, the possibility that as the number two comes off this down screen from number four, um, as he curls it, he may have a wide open layup uh, due to the misdirection. So, um, as you can see, two is going to curl off the four man, and one continues to clear out to the, the corner. What, what the read is here is... Um, the, the man that's going to help um, off as the, as two man curls is most likely going to be the guy guarding the four man, so the guy setting the screen. Um, so our play is designed that we're anticipating um, that man helping to protect the rim. If he doesn't help, we're probably going to have a layup. Um, if he does help, that's how the that's how the play is designed. So we're totally fine. Um, so after the four sets the down screen for the two, he pops high. We look to swing it through the four man as the three pops out quickly. Swing it to the three. Now as this is happening, the two who just came off the curl, if he's not open, he comes right back around. He's going to set a back pick, a big on little screen. Um, and this is where we get the mismatch. So um, if a two sets the good screen, Either five is going to be wide open, or they're probably going to switch the screen, which works to our advantage because we have our, our post player against one of their guards. We should have the size advantage. Um, and also, guards aren't aren't used to handling and hedging screens. Um, it's usually more of a, of a post thing. So we put them in an un uncomfortable position. Um, we look for our five-man coming off off the back screen for, uh, for a good post-up position. Um, if that's not there... Number two and number four go right into setting a double stagger screen for the one in the corner, similar to um, Strong. One comes off the double stagger. If he, sh if he gets the ball and he's open, obviously shoots it. If he doesn't, we go right into spread action. So four out, one in. Both wings um, are wide, and the posts are just doing a little high-low. Um, so one thing to note is, is where the help's coming from. So if we go back a step, and you see um, the one coming off the double stagger, in this case, the man that's probably going to help is the guy guarding the four man. His man is probably going to hedge out and try to help and protect any drive. So realizing that, After the four sets the double the double stagger, the second the second screen, he's going to wheel back around on the opposite side 
that his his man has just hedged from. So four man's defender has hedged on the right side because he was protecting the one coming off the double screen. Now the screen we want to set it coming from the left side because it won't give that defender enough time to wheel back around to be able to hedge coming the other way. That's really hard to hedge on one side and then have to sprint and hedge on the other side. So we want to set the screen come in the opposite direction from where the ball came. So we swing it up top. We look to set that screen coming from the left side now. Um, as the guard's coming off of it, our post player wants to kind of roll high. Number five wants to kind of roll high and open up that lane for the rolling post. As he rolls, point guards um, the first read he's always looking for is the help side from the opposite post. In this case, it's the five man. Um, if his man doesn't help, we obviously are going to have the four rolling for a layup. If the five man's defender does help, we swing it up to the five man and then we look high low. Drop it off and we got a layup.